It's Monday. I mean, I just said it was Friday. Our last PBL, and I need to focus on studying for this final exam. It's in two weeks. Happy Monday, it's Monday again. Welcome back to another week, another vlog. I'm feeling so much better this week than last week. Ah, it is Monday morning, so you already know PBL time. Everything is set up, let's get it. This is our last PBL of this block, and then I'm done with PBL. It's starting, okay. Okay, let me grab my tea. Tea is a Bruin, and <laughs> Bruin, cause I'm a Bruin, cause Okay, 8 a.m. humor. Let's make this tea, sit down, have a great last Monday of PBL ever. And yeah, let me see what our case is called really quick. The case this week is called the case of the leaky lung. So we'll see what that is about. We are learning about farm this week, I believe. So pharmacology, drugs, all of that good stuff. I'm excited. I'm excited. So, I will check in with y'all in a bit. I just want to hop on here and say good morning and welcome to another vlog. So, let's sit down, let's do this PBL, let's knock it out. Differential diagnosis, learning issues, all that fun stuff. I'll see you in a bit. Okay, bye. Oh. Okay, PBL just ended. It was great as usual. We got out actually like 10 minutes early today since it's our last week. I'm like sad, but also not sad <laughs> because PBL stays stressing me out. So our case this week, our patient had cystic fibrosis, which is why it was called the case of the leaky lung. And my learning issue this week is to look up if lung transplants are a good treatment for cystic fibrosis, or not good, just like an effective treatment and how that varies on age and all of that stuff. So I'm very excited to do that. I am going to do my learning issue today because it stresses me out, this PBL learning issue, because it takes me a long time. I feel like it takes me longer than it should. And I feel like it's always just taking away from time that I need to be studying the actual material. So I figured if I knock it out on Mondays before I even have new material to learn since I can't watch the lectures until after 5 p.m. and I don't go to lectures live, so I have this break from now until 5 p.m. technically. Why not knock out PBL? So I think that's gonna be my new go-to thing. Hopefully I can continue that for the next block since this is just the last week of PBL and I'm just now realizing that could be a good idea. But I also wanna get a workout in. I have time today. Mondays are great. But I am also about to get my hair done. I booked an appointment with a home visit hair person. She is gonna come at 10.30. It's probably gonna take a while, so. I'm gonna try and knock out my learning issue while she's doing my hair, but that's it. So, I'll see you later. Okay, bye. Hair is laid. Now, that took six hours. Six hours, but it was worth it. I don't have to worry about my hair anymore. Mm, she's cute all the time. Now I'm gonna run to Costco really quick, and then we're gonna study all oh, night. Study all oh, night. So, oh, I didn't work out today. It's too far gone. We're not working out today. Tomorrow we work out. Oh, am I gonna work out tomorrow? Yeah, I can. We're gonna work out tomorrow just because today was hair. I'm cool with that. So, we'll work out tomorrow and yeah, I'll see y'all when I get back from Costco. Okay, bye. All right, I've made my food. Got a big old bowl of pasta. Really just beef stroganoff, don't judge me. And on the tele, you already know what it's gonna be. There she is. <laughs> we are gonna eat this food, watch Criminal Minds, and then do work. Let's do it. I just wanna say, this professor just said, this is his opening line of his lectures, he says, you can get 100% of the questions right on the exam just by reading my lecture handout. So why would I listen to the lecture then? Like, should I listen to the lecture still? If he just told me I just need to read the handout, it's like a 12 page handout, but that might be the move low key, cause I do a lot better from reading than listening to people talk. We'll see, we'll give it a chance.
just finished watching. Oh, I have the worst headache. Okay. Just finished watching today's lectures. I'm gonna really, really try. I didn't get a chance to do as much PBL as I wanted while I was getting my hair done. I'm gonna try and do as much PBL as I can now just so I don't have to worry about it during the week. This is our last PBL and I need to focus on studying for this final exam. It's in two weeks. So I'm gonna try and knock this PBL out so it's out of sight, out of mind, it's over and also make sure that I get sleep because I didn't get a lot of sleep last night. I got like five hours of sleep, which isn't good. That's the plan and yeah, let's do it. Okay, bye. It is about 9.25 in the morning. I was supposed to get up at 8.15, but my alarm didn't go off. So I'm up now and I was supposed to get up to work out. Still gonna work out, just have a little bit less time now. So still gonna get a workout in. And then I am headed to the anatomy lab for some self-study time. I signed up for time from 10 to 12. So I will just get there at 10.30 instead of 10, that's fine. Yeah, and then we have coronavirus testing. Y'all have to get tested for coronavirus to make sure that everything we're doing on campus is safe. So that is what the plan is today. And then we have clinical skills. But we're gonna start off with a workout. I just have to be a little bit quicker now because my alarm didn't wanna go off. So let's knock this workout out and then let's head to anatomy. I'll see y'all when I make this look nice. All right, we are dressed. We're ready to work out. Wearing the new Gymshark camo. It's so cute. I was taking pictures with my ring light. But now we're gonna get this workout in. We have 15 minutes. So we're gonna do a quick 15 minute hit workout, knock it out, and then head to anatomy. So let's get it. Workout is done, 19 minutes, 200 calories. Like, sis put in that work. I am, oh my gosh, I'm dead. But I'm gonna make a quick protein shake and then head over to anatomy lab and then COVID testing and then clinical skills. I'm feeling good today. This was a great way to start my day. I'm a little annoyed my alarm didn't go off, but I'm also like, probably needed that extra sleep. So maybe that was the Lord trying to tell me something. Let's make the shake and let's get on the road. Okay, bye. All right, on my way to anatomy lab. Just gonna hop in there real quick, look at some structures real quick and then head to clinical skills. Cause yeah, running a little bit behind schedule today that I wanted to be, but we're still good. And then I moved my COVID test to be after class so that I can go to anatomy lab right now. So that's the plan. Yeah, let's do some anatomy review of the cranial nerves and the skull osteology. Okay, bye. It's time. Oh. I'm just gonna stick it up the nose. Y'all, the last video has like 12,000 views. And it's your fault. And I'm here for it. Keep up the good work. <laughs> just finished covid testing and clinical skills the test was not bad just stuck it up your nose like an inch and a half it was a self-administered test so now i'm headed back home to get some studying in i'm walking uphill so i'm so out of breath but yeah it's been a good day so far i'm so hungry i haven't eaten anything today so i'm probably gonna make some indian food when i get home but yeah i just want to check in i'll see you when i get home Okay, bye. Okay, I am back from class, from clinical skills. It was so great. We learned how to do lung exams, chest, back, all of that good stuff, how to listen for breath sounds. Yeah, it was, it was good. We actually got to practice on a standardized patient. So there was a real actor there in a gown who we practiced with, which was awesome. Austin is gonna be my standardized patient for practicing. So now I am back home. I haven't eaten anything all day. So I am going to probably actually make a berry smoothie right now. I'm feeling kind of fruity and like I need to get some greens in. So I'm gonna make a berry smoothie and then sit down, do my Anki cards for today and then watch lectures, make new Anki cards and knock out PBL because I did some of it yesterday, but I need it, it's gotta be done. I'm feeling good, I'm feeling good this week. So let's do it y'all, let's do it.
We did it! Did 120 cards. I'm still so behind for all the other cards, but I did it, I'm feeling good. I feel like I've actually solidified what I learned yesterday in lectures, so that's good. I am now going to knock out PBL and that's just what's next on the list. I'm a little hungry right now, so I might make some food and then watch today's lectures, make Anki cards for that, and then hopefully have time to make notes. Yeah, we'll see. But let's get some food and let's knock out this PBL. Okay, bye. All right, let's find some food. Although I already know what I'm gonna eat. If you know what I'm gonna eat, you should know by now. Pause the video, drop it in the comments what you think it's gonna be. It's in my freezer. Dun, 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 dun. There she is, Trader Joe's butter chicken. Oh yeah. And of course, garlic naan, the best combo. That is what we are having for dinner tonight. I'm so excited, it's been so long since I've had butter chicken, but it's gonna be good. I cook the butter chicken in the microwave, super quick, super easy, and I cook the garlic naan in our little toaster oven, which I've got heating up already. I'm excited to eat. Let's do it. The food has been made. Look at her, she's a beauty. I'm thinking I'm gonna try watching this. Austin's scared, but I'm thinking it could be a winner. We'll give it a try, but if it's bad, I'm just gonna go back to Criminal Minds. So, let's do it. Let's knock out PBL. Make some tea. <laughs> Dude, okay, gonna make some tea. Lavender chamomile, we're gonna get our study and all. Okay, it's like 12, almost 12.15, and I just finished PBL. <laughs> I don't know why PBL takes me so long. It takes me like three and a half, four hours every time. I really struggle with like finding good sources, and I think it's just, I don't know, hopefully I'll get better with it as time goes on because it's something we're gonna have to be doing for a long time. But I did it. Here's what we're looking like. This is my final LI over here. That took me three hours somehow. And then this is all the research that I was doing. So I'm really glad that's out of the way though. I don't have to do PBL for at least like three more weeks. This is the last PBL of block one. I have lectures that I haven't watched from today, two of them but it's midnight, so I'm gonna try and knock out one of them, make those Anki cards so that I have something to study for tomorrow as well, and then just sleep in a little bit. So if I can get in bed by one and maybe like 1.15, I'll wake up in the nines, get a good amount of sleep, still early enough to work out in the morning. That's gonna be the plan. I'm feeling good, which is good, and I'm feeling like I want to study. I don't wanna be behind, so I'm motivated, even though I I don't look like it, but I'm motivated. So I think I'm gonna knock one of these lectures out. Let's go. It's 1.30 a.m. Your girl made it through both lectures. <sighs> Thank you, God. <laughs> I'm so proud of myself. That second lecture was a breeze, so I'm glad that I clicked just to see what it was about and decided to watch it, so I am all caught up. All of the Anki cards are made, so I am good to go for tomorrow. We're starting this week off strong, so I am gonna head to sleep, probably sleep in until about 9.30, get my eight hours, maybe even nine hours, who knows, and then Hopefully have a productive day tomorrow. So, good night, fam. See you in the morning. Good morning, everyone. It is about 10 o'clock in the morning. I've actually been up for an hour because Austin's alarms kept going off, but it's fine. I was gonna sleep in until 10, but I didn't. So I just laid in bed for a little bit, chilled, and now it's time to do some Anki. Starting our morning off right, today is gonna be a chill day. I only have one class and it's online. Usually Wednesdays we have Histopath Lab, but there is no Histopath Lab this week. And I can't say that I'm upset. I am quite happy that I can just do this little virtual lab here. 
I think it's a nerve lab because we're learning about action potentials. And yeah, just study, study, study. I knocked PBL out, I turned her in. So I'm feeling good, things are looking up. So we're gonna knock out these Anki cards and then get in a quick workout. Actually, the workout doesn't have to be quick. Depends on how fast you do these Anki cards. So that's the plan. We're gonna sit right here in this beautiful space, knock out some Anki cards. I'm gonna make some tea. Let's do it. cards today we did 272 cards just now did i do that or is that not accurate oh i only did 150 cards where are they getting this daily average i feel like the knowledge is in my brain though so that is good now that i have done some studying i'm going to do a workout to start the day off right and then i really need to start doing i need to start catching up on all of the other cards from the previous week since the final is coming up and that's the whole point of doing anki so that you can remember things so i am going to start incorporating that as well into my daily schedule along with the new material so let's get a workout in i'm gonna get all cleaned up i'm literally still in my pajamas so i'll see y'all when it's nice all right she's dressed she's ready ah let's crush this workout i do only have 30 minutes now because i waste a lot of time so i'm just gonna do a quick abs and hit workout just knock it out 30 minutes and then we'll be sitting right back at the desk for nerve lab so let's get it okay workout is done class has already started i was watching a little bit of it while i finished the workout but it's just the lecture portion before lab gonna make a protein shake and then sit down and do this nerve lab let's go nerve lab is done I'm gonna need to study a lot of what was discussed, but that's fine. So now I have the rest of the day free. Free, no PBL, no lec. Oh, I do have to watch lecture. No PBL though, so it's lit. So I'm gonna sit here and make some notes. I'm gonna go through yesterday's lecture handouts, Monday and yesterday's lecture handouts, make my notes consolidate the information and then once five hits probably a little bit later than that i will watch today's lectures so i'm feeling good this is home for a long time okay let's do it bye here we go about 8 30 I have just been going through the first few lectures from this week and making notes it's been going well actually and I feel like I'm understanding stuff but I'm hungry so made my shrimp pasta it's been a minute since I had this and I'm really excited to eat it so yeah, I'm gonna eat this, watch some Criminal Minds, and then I have to watch today's lectures. And then we have an anatomy practical tomorrow. It's a practice one, so it doesn't count for anything, but we still have to turn it in, so I kinda wanna do okay. So I'm gonna study for that. I'll see you after I finish eating. Okay, bye. Lectures and laundry. That is what is about to happen. I need to fold all of this and i'm going to watch today's lecture i'm a little bit overwhelmed if i'm being honest i was feeling so good until <sighs> right now I'm, a, I'm like worried about this anatomy practical even though i know it doesn't count for anything but i like still want to do well and i don't want them to think that i don't know how to study for anatomy i'm just annoyed that it's a practice i don't need practice i need to be able to study for the final which is what counts for my grade all right let's fold these clothes lectures and laundry
time it is past midnight, but I watched both lectures. These are the things that bring me joy. I'm so proud of myself. I'm not behind. I am caught up. I was able to watch on like three and a half times speed and still understand everything. <sighs> My brain is just moving faster. So I have to get up early in the morning because Gymshark is dropping some new releases and I have to do a story haul. Everything launches at 11 a.m. but I have anatomy lab office hours to study for this practical at 10 a.m. So I need to do this haul at like 8 a.m. and it's past midnight but I also don't feel comfortable like going to sleep without reviewing anatomy at all. So I am gonna get some studying time in and some anatomy lab time in. It's gonna be great, it's gonna be fine. I'm feeling good this week. I think I'm doing a really good job staying on top of the material. Let's hope that I can keep this up because the final is in less than two weeks and like what? There's a lot of information. Each week feels like an entire quarter. It's fine, so I'm just gonna do a quick bit of anatomy review so that I feel good going into tomorrow and then head to sleep. So I will see y'all in the morning because I'm gonna review in bed, okay? Good night, fam. See you in the morning. I'm awake. It's like 8.15. I'm running on like five hours of sleep. So a nap is probably in my future today, but I have to film this haul <laughs> for Gymshark. So I'm gonna do that now and then head to anatomy lab that starts at 10. I'll see y'all. All right, on my way to anatomy lab. I'm just going for office hours because we have a practice practical today. Then I have anatomy actual class at like one to three. So lots of anatomy today. Wear figs, of course. Is there anything else? But I'm excited to solidify these structures in my brain and hopefully do well enough on the practical even though it doesn't count. So far so good. I'll check in with y'all in a bit. Okay, bye. Okay, I just got, th this black mask is sleek, y'all. Okay, anyway, I just got out of anatomy, um, self-study, it was so good. Oh my gosh, I love going to the lab alone and just studying like what I wanna study, you know? I'm feeling so prepared for this practice practical. It's not even that, it's not even that deep day. I'm still gonna do a few more like flashcard reviews right now while I eat lunch. I have actual class at, at one and it's 11.55. So I'm gonna do um, a little bit of flashcard review on Anki. Yeah, I'll see y'all later. Okay, bye. Okay, so the store had frozen foods. So we're going with mac and cheese, vitamin water, that's the best I got. So yeah, I'm just gonna eat and study. Let's go. Okay, hey family. My hair is a hot mess. So just got done with anatomy lab and our practice practical, practice practical. It was good, it was fine. I've taken practicals before. I'm a little annoyed just because the TAs told me different things than were the actual answers, but it is what it is. I'm confident in my ability to do an anatomy practical. I literally only studied today. So the fact that I, I'm pretty sure I passed. Yes, your girl passed. Just had to calculate to make sure. Now it is time to make sure that everything is in my brain for the final. The final is coming up. I used to, in college, study for finals one week out from the exam date. That was like crunch time. But for med school, I'm thinking I'm gonna need two weeks. So that's about right now. Our final is Wednesday, October 7th, and it is Thursday now. So a little bit under two weeks. So I need to start getting that together so that's the plan we're gonna go home we have to watch today's lectures tomorrow is the last pbl thank goodness and i just need to make sure that i am on top of my stuff for this final because this is the one thing that actually counts for our grade in the block you have to pass the final to pass the block and to be a doctor eventually so i'm gonna get some food i haven't eaten much today maybe i'll make food at home i don't know i'm just gonna eat and then study so let's get it oh sorry <laughs> I feel like I also didn't say we did a whole ultrasound lab today too, which was so cool So I was paired with Jared and Jeremiah who you've seen in my previous vlogs and we were like ultrasounding our necks 
So I got to see just a lot of cool structures from ultrasound. We got to see the internal jugular vein. We got to see the carotid artery, the thyroid gland, all of that good stuff. It was super cool and we like learned how to hold the probe, how to put on the ultrasound gel, all of that. So I just wanna share because that was super fun and that's what we did after the practical. So it was kind of like a chill, interesting session. Yes, I'm gonna head home. I'll see you later. Okay, bye. Okay, so. I finished eating, it was good, I had a nice quesadilla, watched a little bit of Criminal Minds, and now it is time to do these Anki cards. So I didn't do today's do cards yet, just because this morning was crazy, so now I'm finally sitting down at 5.30 p.m. to do my Anki cards. So I'm gonna knock those out and then make notes and then watch today's lectures. So that is the plan. Here's Anki and let's do it. We did it, 137 cards. I almost fell asleep at the end. I'm so tired. Maybe I should watch lecture now before I like, can't. Yeah, maybe that's a good idea. I'm so tired. I'm either gonna watch lectures now or start making my notes now while I watch Criminal Minds. We're getting it done, y'all. Okay, bye. <laughs> All right, I've decided to watch lectures. I don't know, my brain has just started working faster. So I watched this guy on three, at least three point speed. And I'll play a little bit for you so you can hear how fast it is. Let me know if you can understand this, but this is what works for me. Cell, uh, do lots of manipulations on a single cell. And if you inject RNA it's into climbing. the cell, uh, cloned RNA into the cell, it will express the transport you're interested in. Double. You can study this uh, very easily. So the cell volume, if you take uh, uh, the ovary out, dissect out individual oocytes and there we go. Media, the cell volume is constant. And this means that there's no net water flow in or out of the cell. Okay, look good. So, water flow. How do we measure water flow? So it's not generally by getting isotope. <laughs> finished lectures they were good one of them was on action potentials and like membrane stuff which is what we've been learning and then we just transitioned to pharmacology really quick and that is what tomorrow monday and tuesday and i think like some of wednesday is on that's our last little bit of this block and then that's it so i actually really enjoyed pharmacology People say they don't like it, but I thought it was really interesting. I'm probably gonna do a little bit of studying, looking through lecture notes and taking notes on my iPad before going to sleep. I'm gonna watch some Criminal Minds. I'll check in with y'all later. Okay, peace. Okay, I lied, I'm not studying anymore. I am going to edit my Instagram video that I forgot I had in bed so I can post it tomorrow and watch Criminal Minds in bed. So I'll see y'all in the morning. Okay, good night. Happy Friday. I'm feeling so rested, thank God. It's Monday, I mean, I just said it was Friday. It's Friday, it is our last day of PBL for this entire block, last one. We are presenting our learning issues today. My learning issue was on lung transplantation survival rates in cystic fibrosis and how that varies with age, um, severity of disease, all of that stuff. And they're opening it up now. So, got my tea a brewing. I'm gonna sit down, knock out this last PBL, and then study all day. <sighs> all right, just finished PBL. Last PBL of the block. Can't say I'm upset. It's over, it's done. <sighs> it was fun though. So, now I am finishing up editing my Instagram post for today. Then gonna do Anki cards, then gonna work out. That's the plan. And then study all day, all day. I'm so excited to study. We're gonna have a productive Friday. My last like two Fridays, I feel like, haven't been very productive, but this Friday is gonna be productive. So let's finish editing this video. I'm almost done, I'm just writing the caption. I'm gonna post it, then gonna knock out Anki cards and then do a, I'm just gonna do a really solid workout, like 
a long one too. Okay, so that's the plan. See you in a bit. Okay, bye. All right, it's Anki time. Let's knock out these cards and feel productive this morning. Here we go. All right, I did it. I finished Anki. Week seven, did 170 something cards, farm. 70 cards. Uh, I still need to make Anki cards for weeks one through three, which I'm absolutely gonna make. It doesn't take me that long to make the cards. I was able to make week fours in like three hours. So it's a lot easier after I've already seen the material to know what to put in the cards. So I'm gonna do that. But right now I'm feeling good. I'm gonna work out. So I'm gonna clean myself up, get in a killer workout that I deserve. See y'all in a bit. We're dressed. We're ready to go, We're ready to get this workout in. I think I'm gonna do a leg day and some hit cardio cause you know, why not? I got time. I got time today, it's Friday. Ooh, 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 I can do what I need to do. So I'm gonna have a nice long workout today, probably legs and hit and then sit back here to study. Let's get it on. Okay, it's been like four hours, five hours since I picked up the camera but Finish my workout, I'm feeling good, I'm showered, I'm clean, and now I'm in bed. But I'm actually gonna watch lectures right now just to make sure that I am on top of things. So I'm gonna watch lectures and knock that out. I ordered some food to eat while I watch lectures, and then I'm gonna sit and write notes since I don't have any Anki cards to do because I already did them. And I love watch the lectures, so now I can just focus on solidifying the material. Just wanna check in, gonna grab my food. What did I get? I got a burger. So I'm gonna eat that, watch these lectures, and then get to going. So let's do it. Translate into longer and higher drug levels of body. And again, when we start to leave that idealized therapeutic window in terms of plasma concentrations. So I just finished watching lectures. They were long, but I made it through somehow it's like nine i'm upset that i feel like the day is kind of gone i took forever to work out which maybe i needed that break because i've been really productive this week i'm gonna go take notes hopefully that'll be a chill way to end friday and let's keep getting that work in y'all we're almost we're almost done hello i'm back so i just finished studying I was making notes, just understanding things a little bit better while watching Criminal Minds, hung out with Austin. This has been a really good week. It's now one something in the morning, which means it's time for the weekend. We have a final in less than two weeks. One day at a time, we are going to get this done. So thank you for tuning in for another week in medical school vlog. I love doing these and I love documenting my journey and just how I'm feeling, how I'm doing. So much better than last week. So. Thanks for tuning in and I will see you next week for another vloggy vlog. Okay, bye.